Hello. I'm teaching a workshop in a couple of months' time with my good friend, Morchine McNamara, called Reawakening Care and Touch. And so I wanted to offer a little taster experience for you um, to give you a sense of some of the ways in which we're going to be entering the work, but also just to give you a, a like a flavour of how much there is to be discovered in this realm. So anyone can do this experiment. You don't have to, as long as you've got two arms, and a place to sit at a table. And the invitation is your right hand is the practitioner or you might like to think of it as the giver and your left hand is the receiver or you might like to think of it as the client or maybe partner or whatever. Uh, so right hand's receiver, left hand is, uh, no, right hand is giver, left hand is receiver. And this is an experiment in beginning to be able to learn to discern and feel the, the territory of aliveness that sits beyond the skin. So we all know that we can feel that fit, fit, the skin is a sensory organ, right? And some of us are lucky enough to have a positive association with that. In this exploration, we're going to be exploring what the possibility for sensing the aliveness off the skin is and where that sensory apparatus begins to kick in, might begin to kick in. So I'm going to tilt the screen down so you can see my hand so I can give you a little example of it. Right hand is the giver, left hand is the receiver. Um, I, I invite you to put your awareness into your left hand for a moment. Um, imagine that your attention is in your left hand and your right hand is coming towards the left hand, sensing with your left hand, sensing with your left hand. At what point are you able to discern the presence of your right hand? At what point are you able to discern the presence? If you like, you can come quite close until you're definitely sure you can feel it. And then just bring it away into that kind of cusp place, the place where you're not sure if you're feeling anything, but maybe you are. I don't know. Just play around there. Sensing, sensing, awareness, awareness with your left hand. Great, and then let that go. And now this time swap. So this time your awareness is in your right hand. Still your right hand is the practitioner, left hand is the receiver. And now bring your right hand towards your left hand again, but this time your awareness is in your right hand. At what point are you able to feel the arriving presence of the alive being that is your left hand, the, the alive sacred being that is your left hand? using your right hand, at what point is your right hand able to discern that there's something living there, something alive there, the warmth of aliveness? And again, you might like to go quite close so that you can definitely identify it. For some of you, it might be like almost till you're touching or maybe you can touch and then come away and see if you can still feel it. Um, notice where it definitely isn't and then notice where it begins to be. Great, and then let that go. And now this time, bringing those two places together, so bringing the receiver in the direction of the one making offering contact, and notice where you begin to feel that field between the two. And what's the nature of the field between the two places of contact, the practitioner and the client, the giver and receiver. And for some of you, it might feel maybe like a very, very low hum. For others, it might feel like warmth. Um, for some, it might feel like a kind of vibration or a, like a frequency. So when we approach another, this relational field is already alive with sensation and already busy with attention way before we come into physical contact. So the invitation of this experiment is ju just beginning to become alive to the aliveness, the possibility of aliveness way before you come into contact with another. That's it. <laughs> Enjoy playing around. I'd love to hear how you get on and what you discover, what surprises you, um, what you, uh, yeah, what you discover on the other side of it. Um, try it a number of times. Notice if it changes.
Okay. Have a lovely day.